I don't think it's been officially picked up. Have you heard something that I have? <laughs> I hope that means it's going to get picked up. Uh, it's a, it was a pilot that I shot for HBO uh, about five months ago, um, directed by Gus Van Zandt, who is one of my favorite directors in the world. Uh, he got an Oscar nomination for uh, Good Will Hunting. Uh, and he directed, um, earlier in his career, he did a, a, a movie called My Private Idaho. Uh, with Rivers Phoenix before he died yeah. and, and Keanu Reeves about two uh, hu two gay hustlers prostitutes who one of them had aphasia and so he waked up he woke up in the middle of nowhere and, and, and he wakes up a lot in the film in the middle of nowhere and has no idea how he got there and he has to figure it out but the whole thing is based on Henry V by Shakespeare <laughs> And it works. It's just a, it's 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 a really atmospheric, beautiful, strange film. Um, so he was directing, which was good. And then uh, the writer, producer of Orange Is the New Black is the writer, the main writer, creator of the project. So it was. It's the uh, when I got the role, my manager was like, James, you do realize this is the project everyone in Los Angeles wanted to be a part of. So you know, learn your lines. <laughs> And uh, they cast me as the hero. Uh, it's about the Salem witch trials. And so it's really about a community that eats itself alive. And there's not a lot of heroes in that story, frankly. But there's one, and that's me. Uh, which means that they killed me. Uh, uh, they assured me that they wouldn't kill me in the first season. <laughs> so hopefully I'll last a couple seasons before they crush me to death. Uh, but it was really nice to play the, the hero, frankly. You know, like I'm used to playing the villain. Um, it is, uh, there are going to be scenes that make it a lot of people angry, frankly. Um, like Game of Thrones does a lot of cheesecake, a lot of beefcake. They do a lot of sexy scenes. But uh, the sexuality in this is a lot edgier. I don't want to give too much away, but... Um, it, it will offend people, and I, I don't mind offending people. I think sometimes that's when you know you're you're, you're doing something memorable. Um, but what I will say is that everything in it, uh, no matter how racy or controversial, it feeds the theme of the of the story. It's not just in there gratuit gratuitously. It all adds up to something. It's real art, and uh, HBO said that they were more excited about it than they've ever been about any project. Uh, they love the dailies. They, they basically cannibalized all their television shows for the top people, like their top director of photography, their top computer effects, their, the, all the top people, they cannibalized and brought them together to make this thing. And so we're just waiting to see if it's picked up. Uh, and if it is, we, uh, we are waiting for winter to descend on the East Coast again so that they can freeze us to death again <laughs> outside. And, and that was the only part of it that was hard. That was so cold. Like when, you, when you're shooting, when, you're, when, you, when you go to the snow, you get cold, but you have like insulation, you know? You have boots. And we have, you know, period costume, which is just thin leather and thin soled shoes, and you, you, you get hypothermia, frankly, but it's worth it. So. Got another question over here?